In this video, I'm going to show you how to accept cryptocurrency payments on your Elementor website using a free plugin called the Cryptocurrency Widgets for Elementor. And you can accept Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, and a lot more other cryptocurrencies straight out of the box in your Elementor website. I'll as well show you how to add a cryptocurrency widget just like this over here to show your website visitors the current changes and market price for that specific cryptocurrency that you're accepting on your Elementor website. Without any further ado, let's jump straight into the video. Back inside your Elementor dashboard, go to plugins and add a new plugin. Search for cryptocurrency widgets for Elementor. You'll get this plugin over here called Cryptocurrency Widgets for Elementor by Cool Plugins. Install it and have it activated. I have it installed and activated on my website. Under the crypto plugins, you're going to come to Open Exchange API and you'll have to create an API key and connect it to your website. In this case, simply click over here and create a free API key. Once you are here on the Open Exchange Rates website, simply sign up for a free account. Once you're done creating up your account, you'll be sent an email to verify your account. Once you verify your account, come back inside your Open Exchange account and under App IDs, you'll be able to get your API key. Simply copy it and head back inside your WordPress dashboard under the Open Exchange API and paste it over there. Now that we've created our API key, now let's go straight into our Elementor website and add our crypto widgets and even accept crypto payments on our website. I'll go to my pages, all pages. I'll open up my homepage with Elementor. I'll come straight to my menu under here. And now when I go to my widgets area, there is a new section that has been added to my widgets and that is the cryptocurrency widgets. These are Elementor widgets that you can simply drag into your Elementor editor and style up to how you want them to be. I'm going to start with a crypto widget. This basically gives us the current statistics of that specific coin. In this case, this is Bitcoin. This is the current market price and just had a little increase of 0.14%. It shows you the rankings, the other changes in the past 7 days, 24 hours, 1 hour, the market cap, and the difference in the last 24 hours. Alright, now over here you have the widget type. You can choose whether to show a label, a list, and once you select the list option, you can show coins of the top 5, the top 10, the top 20, top 100, or all the 200 coins. You can choose to show the top gainer and the loser. You can choose to show an advanced table. And depending where you place it on your Elementor website, it will take advantage of that space. And you have the coins listed over here and the changes in the last 24 hours, as well as the market cap, the volume and the supply. I'm going to go back over here and I display a card. And the coin I want to display is Bitcoin because for demo purposes, this website is currently going to be accepting Bitcoin. So I choose Bitcoin from the drop down. But you can choose Ethereum, Tether, BNB, USD coin. Solana, Dogecoin, Litecoin, and all these other cryptocurrencies listed down below here. Now here I want to select the fiat currency. You can choose USD, Great Britain Pound, Euro, the Japanese Yen, and all these other currencies down below here. You can choose to show the formatting, either to show the 24 hour changes, 7 day changes, 30 day changes. For example, if I deactivate this option, 30 day changes, it should disappear. That's it. The market cap can also be activated or deactivated. I'll leave this here on the default settings. Under the review box, you can submit a review about your experience on the cryptocurrency widgets for Elementor. Under the pro cryptocurrency widgets, you have additional plugins that you can install and enable more cryptocurrency features on your Elementor website. All right, back into our settings, I'm going to add another widget. And that is going to be the crypto donation widget. This is the widget that will allow us to enable crypto payments on our Elementor website. With the widget selected, I'm going to come over here to the widget type. And instead of using a tabular format, I'll use a list format. Under the wallet address, you'll have to add your Bitcoin wallet. Because you're only accepting Bitcoins on your Elementor website. I'll paste my wallet address. And over here, I'll add the wallet address meta. Awesome. Under extra settings, the description over here I'll choose to say BTC payment. 
via MetaMask. I can as well change the MetaMask title. So this to payment with MetaMask. The main title over here, I can change it as well to pay the coin name, which is BTC for us to this address, which is the QR code, or they can simply copy the address over here. That means that your website visitor can either scan the QR code or simply copy the wallet address and use it to make the payment. Once that is done, you can further go and make custom stylings for your donation widget under style. You can change the primary color, the background color, the border type, the border radius. I'll change that to 15 so that it can match with the cryptocurrency widget over here. For now, this widget is still limiting us because we cannot change the typography settings. But the good thing is that it is using our theme styles that we set up in Elementor. Under advanced, we can as well play along with the padding. On the left hand side, we can add a padding of let me say 20. Let's now update and have a preview of our cryptocurrency widgets. Right here is our cryptocurrency widget showing the Bitcoin price and the market cap and all the details over here. In fact, I've just noticed that, that there has been a decline in the price of the Bitcoin currently. And also here we have our donation or payment widget, which will enable our website visa to make us a payment. In this case, they'll pay Bitcoin to this address, which they can scan with their phone or simply copy our wallet address and pay us straight to the wallet. Don't show that you can as well show different cryptocurrencies over right here in the cryptocurrency widget. For example, if I select the Ethereum currency, it will show up over there. And as well, you can accept Ethereum as a payment or donation. I'll choose Ethereum and you have to add your wallet address. And under extra settings, you have to change and indicate the kind of currency your website visitor will have to pay. If we look into the responsive settings of these widgets, let me go straight to the mobile device. Our cryptocurrency widget looks good. If we look at our payment or donation cryptocurrency widget, we can do some custom changes under advanced and make the padding. I'll leave everything to be zero zero and it already looks good. Awesome. So I simply have now to update and I'm good to go. To close up this tutorial, I have to mention that this is the free version of the cryptocurrency widgets for Elementor. But as well, there's a pro version that even extends the free version of the cryptocurrency widgets for Elementor. The most interesting feature for me in the pro version is that you actually get the live price changes, the market cap, volume, historical charts, and crypto calculator because they use another API different from the open exchange free API. And of course, you have other features like the moving price ticker, the historical charts, accordion sliders and cards, crypto calculator, color settings, and a lot more. Alright, without wasting much of your time, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope now you have an idea on how you can accept crypto payments on your Elementor website without having to install WooCommerce, but simply integrating with the Open Exchange Free API. Use the widgets from the cryptocurrency widgets for Elementor plugin and you are good to go. If you like this video, please make sure that you give it a like. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Have a good time and goodbye.